Our officials, Brian Hall, Kristen Bell, and Kaz Beverly, and we are underway. UCA is not a very big team, Brett Dolan. Pretty small. Razorbacks will have a huge height advantage in this ball game. Arkansas had that win against a smaller UAPB team. Sailor Poffenberger on the drive. They're going to get her for an offensive. She said, hey, we're going to have to play a lot better than giving up 83 against K-State. Defense is going to have to be good. It's a UCA team that shot 30% from the field the other day. Knocked down three three three-pointers. Mitchell controlling for the Sugar Bears. And the ball back in their hands. You can see they're being pretty patient. They're using that shot clock. I think they're going to want to try to shorten this game as much as they can. There's the drive, and the shot won't drop, and the rebound grabbed by Arkansas and Christy Carr. Yeah, that was Kenley Fisher on the drive. Here's Arkansas. They're in transition. That's one of the things they do best. Take it away by Carter. But you're right, Zeke. Coach Rushing felt like the shot selection was too quick. She wants yeah. to play a different pace today. Well, you can see they got on a semi-fast break right there, and they pull it out and call a set play. It's all controlled. Foul. A foul on a three. She put one hand up, but she put her chest and her body into the into the three-point shooter. All will want that same call on the other end. Do you ever think Sierra Carter shot free throw? There's a lot of noise here with the elementary kids. Hey, she knocked down all three. Well, she's a you know, nice soft touch there. Got a little bounce, especially on that last one. She missed the first one, though, Brett. The shot won't go from Poffenbarger. Sailor's got a pretty shot. That's a nice, fluid shot from the right side. She's going to be a very – she's a 6-2, 6-3 guard for Coach Mike Neighbors. You see Colin plays, very structured, Brett. Very – look at there, nice backdoor cut. A little bit too much on it, and it squeaked through. But UCA's trying to be methodical and controlled on the offensive end. Spencer on the drive with the right hand. Throws it off. From Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Free throws have been absolutely awful. His teams have shot free throws because there's a lot of Chelsea Dungy and a lot of Amber Ramirez that are really good shooters. For the Sugar Bears against the Wildcats. Look at the shooter. Watch the ball come out of the shooter's hands, and then you can go get it. There's Barnum posting up, pump fake, all kinds of kind. Love that pump fake, and that's a nice play to have. In your- Barnum had 15 the other night, went 3 of 13 from the line, but she makes that pass looks like it went through the hands of Fisher, able to gather back in beyond the arc. It's going to be a walk. Traveling. Yep. Coach Neighbors has done a good job at Arkansas, and he's made his he's made one SEC championship game appearance, lost, but had a great run, and he's done a good job at Arkansas. He just hasn't been able to quite get. It's a different league now. She's moved up. Their travel's much more difficult. It's not all buses and heading to southeastern Louisiana now. I never thought I'd see a day where UCA would be in the Atlantic <laughs> Sun, but that's the era of college athletics now. Daniel. That was a nice pass to Warren Carter. Yeah, I was uh, I was a little bit surprised, and, and she she can shoot the basketball. Good shooter, but she has had some struggles shooting at times. But I think uh, Coach Neighbors knows Chrissy Carr is someone he's going to really be able to count on. Plateau in the NCAA tournament against Utah. Three early points today. That shot won't drop from Atkins, and the Razorbacks try to get a little bit of separation. Just three of nine are the Hogs from the field here in this first quarter. Well, right there, their guard 13 decided. Daniels, another nice bounce pass. Dowda, though, can't finish. Yeah, Miriam just got to power that up. She kind of tried to shift in the air with the ball. She's one of the tallest players. These teams are a little bit like these old guys sitting at center court. Takes us a while to get going in the morning. (laughs) (laughs) It's not quite noon yet, so... Just don't feel right for a game. It's 13-9, Arkansas. Right, Arkansas is going to be four out, one in, just to, just to box across here. Screen for the ball handler. Spencer had a path cut off. Jersey has to hoist. Wow. Hits the three at the end of the first. She looks 100% right now. Aaron Barnum had four quick points. Comes to that jump stop. Her path cut off. 
And Chrissy Carr sees one drop through the second. That's off. Barnum the rebound. Goes over a couple of bodies and around. And then missed at the rim. Yeah, I don't know how that didn't go in. That's just like one of those, like, you're right there. It's just got to fall. Here's a knockdown. Yeah. Daniels to inbound. Yeah, Michaela's going to be the inbounder this season when her when she's in there. And when it's not her in the game, it'll be Samara Spencer as the inbounder unless something changes. Wow. Here's Daniels stepping up. Let these young ladies play as much as you can. Quick three from Fisher. Rebound to Carr. Almost halfway through our second quarter. Fast paced. How about Daniels weaving and darting? Not really any ball pressure. Just drop back. There you go. Go to that glass. Out of able to gather and school. Maybe. Might be it for her for a career. Mike has teased the fact, calling it an off year now. Yeah. So who knows if we'll oh, see. I, I think Sasha she'll be back. back. I'm not privy to any information, but I saw her before the game, and uh, she was all, sitting over by the bench watching warm-ups, had a nice visit, but she's always very pleasant, very nice. She looks like you know, she's got big, strong legs. She's got good shoulders. Well, she's holding Pretty. that right wrist though and she's got a left thumb issue we'll explain later on can the Sugar Bears hold for a final look they'll take the basket instead and they're in these tough road games or tough SEC home games where Aaron can get fouled quite a bit with her offensive skill and she goes up there and buries two foul shots that's Kayla Mitchell in the SWAC band was performing. That's incredible. So he's gone back to back with Pine Bluff and Elementary Day at Bud Walton. Yeah, that, it'll it'll kind of come back down a little bit next week. But uh, that this is a fun atmosphere, and I saw all the clips from UAPB Clemens Arena. Look at Carr, that right hand up, good follow through. That's good beef right there. Good balance, elbow in, eyes on the target, extension. Follow through. That's a good beef shot right there. Let's talk a little more about Christy Carr, time permitting. As that's a nice drive to the basket wow. by Paris. And it is a painful injury. It's weird losing. You know, just a little, you know, anything with your fingernail can hurt. And so when you just lose it, that is a big thing, especially to a basketball player. She's got all kinds of years of eligibility. Arkansas wanted a foul on Jersey. Okay. She tried to catch and score. The sugar- Kentucky has had some really good bigs in the past. And there's been some teams that had great size and been very effective with size. Old Miss the last two years, not as shorter. Sailor and Michaela playing basketball. I think they played lacrosse against each other as well. Lacrosse. Yeah, there was a wow. couple of sports involved in yeah, it. But, I'm not, uh, I don't know much about lacrosse. I'd have I to really study up did. on it. I would probably be really good at it. I guarantee <laughs> I could coach it. I, I know I could coach it. I just have to get a little training, and they make a three. Fifteen threes, and Kayla Mitchell brings one in, so that's a good feeling yeah, for the Sugar good, Bears. Good for them. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Hey, UCA's played hard. They've they come out. Coach hard. Rushing's coached them hard. She's been aggressive with her team. She hadn't been just sitting on the bench and being quiet. She's been very aggressive. She's trying to encourage. Great cut. And when you're an older kid and you're that unselfish, that just spreads beautiful love throughout your team. And that makes everyone want to be a good passer. Hey, two in a row. Yeah. If not, kick it out. Somebody's going to be wide open. And you're going to knock a shot. How about Sailor? Back-to-back blocks. Yeah. It's hard to block two shots in a game. It's pretty hard to block two in one possession. Langerman hit a three earlier. She gets a six. Riley Energy. Michaela, experienced point guard with three bigs. Chrissy's big, too, now. You got Chrissy, you got Aaron Barnum, and you got Sailor. That's a lot of size together. They can all make an offensive play. But they all bring something different yes, to the equation. This is a good five out here together. It's a good five. None against Samara Spencer or Jersey or Miriam. I love Miriam. All those five together. They have a good little flip. They got nice, smooth, fluid. They space together well. And it seems like a team that could be out there together a lot throughout this season. That was a nice basket by Fisher, the Greenwood native. She has seven points for UCA. And Barnum has to shoot quickly. She's been in the lane for a while, and she'll get the hoop. They just need wins to develop confidence. And you know how those two go hand-in-hand, hand, wins and confidence. Yeah, absolutely. Coach Rushing's a good coach. She's been around college basketball her whole life. She was. I remember watching her teams play when I'd go over to watch Arkansas Tech play, and she was the head coach at Delta. Great pass. Samara We'll see Lauren Lindsay get the heave up a three-pointer. That's an over the back. I'd like to see Lauren get an open look. She might. He got a few seconds left. Arkansas at 72 points for the game. About to go to 2-0. They'll be back Monday when Tulsa comes to town. Two games next week at home. 2-0. Beat two in-state teams. 
Let's see right here. We get it happens on this little fast break. Nice job. Carly pull Johnson it pulled yeah, it up. Yeah, I like that. You know, Coach Neighbors, all class, ain't trying to score. Well, yeah, I'm just going to hold the ball. That's what you should do. You're winning. Do it with class. I like that. Good job. Good job. 